Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your mid-monthly reading. Uh, it's going to be a general read. Whatever comes up, comes out. Could be love, could be career. I do shuffle prey over the cards off camera. I have brought back the $15 special reading. Take advantage of that over at my website. All information is below of how to contact me, how to go to the website. All information is below, okay? Alright, so... Let's get started, all right? We're going to do a five-card advice spread. The first card is you, Sagittarius, right where you are. Okay. The second card is, are you on your correct path? The third card, what is the main obstacle? Okay. And what is helping you? How can progress be made here? Right. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Six of Cups. Wow. All right, so this could be you, you either having those nostalgic thoughts of the past, of someone from the past, or someone right now from the present who you feel or you deem as a soulmate. Uh, your situation could involve children. Your situation could involve you dealing with someone younger than you. Your situation could involve a level of inequality in in some type of aspect we'll see let's go let's go you right where you are oh the ten of wands laying the burden down yes laying it down it's too much it's too much to carry you're carrying it all by yourself and you're carrying it in the most um what was the word I just came up in my mind the most uh, difficult way like most people would throw it over their back you be carrying it in the front of you it's almost as if you you're hiding behind the burden like you know something is a burden but you still you're still pushing forward hmm. that's your energy uh, Aries Sagittarius Leo are you on your correct path? The death card. Uh, Aquarius got the, it's in the same spot. Are you on your correct path? Transformation. Endings and new beginnings need to happen. This is the fifth month of the year. Fives are about change. Everyone is enacting some type of change. Course correction. New direction in their life. Especially in this month. Okay, let's move forward. And what is the main obstacle? You, temperance. Maybe you're off balance. Maybe you need to gain balance. Uh, maybe you need to wait for perfect timing. Some of you are praying for perfect timing. Some of you are um, energy workers. Tarot card readers, psychics, light workers, whatever, Reiki healing, energy. The amount of work has you um, kind of off, and you know that something needs to change here. Like, you feel like um, something is raping your energy. It's just. Ooh, okay, let's keep going. What is helping you? The Page of Pentacles. Maybe a younger earth sign. If not a younger earth sign, uh, a message of stability is coming or has come or is here for you. You need to take advantage of it completely. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I didn't even know. Okay, all right. <laughs> Sometimes I say stuff and I'm just like, in a mental fog so that's for somebody anyway how can progress be made Knight of cups you're gonna have to get creative in how to find balance here um also some of you need to be accepting to someone's emotional advances because it might stabilize you a bit let's see what's going on here Okay, all right, I'll go with it because I'm feeling like I need to. There's our endings there. 
uh, Ten of Swords, Ten of Cup, the Emperor. Some of you are dealing with an Aries, if not a Taurus. If not, for my Aquarius man, you are the husband, you are the guide, you are the the overseer, you are the everything here. This could be a woman too, but get more masculine energy. Um, for a while, my Aquarius man has been trying to get to a water sign or someone with water heavy in their chart. A lot of my Aquarius men are partnered to either Earth signs, uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And they know that moving away from this situation will cause ultimate betrayal. It'll leave someone, maybe an earth sign feeling, I mean, an air sign feeling backstabbed and betrayed. You also are taking into account your children with the six of cups. You may have children with this person, your father figure. You're trying to just figure out how does this look for you. Uh, some of you are tired of sneaking around. What's the Ten of Wands? What's the Ten of Wands for Sagittarius? Alright, Ten of Wands is the burden is being laid down because the universe spirit is revealing to maybe an air sign who's been snooping around that, you know, something's going on here. Some information was revealed. Someone was looking into something, looking at something. And it just caused a shit storm. It caused for the tower to come down because, um, you know, it was already here in the first place. The death card, the six of swords. Yeah, you wanted to move away from a time of turbulence, chaos, drama, fighting, arguing, uh, ego, somebody trying to be better than the other. You want to move away from maybe an air sign who causes this for you. Um because maybe you found new love for self or with someone else could be a cancer pisces scorpio ace of cups here page of pentacles what's the page of pentacles the world yeah they'll be there okay so you've gone as far as you can go in a significant relationship if it's romantic if it's work or career related there's a burden in in for some of you, um, energy-wise, this is physical energy, emotional energy, mental energy. Um, you have to get creative on how you transmute and transform someone completely raping your time and energy. Um, there's an ending here with, with someone or something. You've gone as far as you can go here. Uh, learn the lesson and move on. You know, page of cup, uh, knight of cups in the star. Accepting this healing, uh, accepting this cup brings healing for you. There might even be an Aquarius uh, uh, involved. Aquarius might be extending their emotion here. Yeah, that's definitely an Aquarius. Four of Wands, Three of Cups, Eight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, The Hermit, The Devil, and The Two of Cups, Ace of Swords, Judgment, Moon. Alright, so. Yeah. Alright, so. Um, if you're dealing with an Aquarius, Aquarius really wants to make this work, really wants to heal a situation um you may even be wanting uh, reconciliation with this aquarius they may be trying to work on it with you king of wands um some of you a partner with an earth sign maybe a virgo um they've gone within they're tired of this toxic situation they know that there's love here but they need truth and clarity so that they can have a new and fresh start and make a final decision. Even not knowing where this will lead or feeling like they don't have the full picture, the full scope of things. Um, but they're just ready to uh, move away from Sagittarius. Uh, because they feel like this is just 
they put so much work into this. There's an inequality that here. Someone's giving more to this relationship than the other. Someone cares for, and they they don't want they want victory in their own right. Or or a queer uh, or Sagittarius, you're, you're very pompous. You're very arrogant. And that's why there's then inequality, and they're gonna be like the Queen of Swords, or you could be dealing with the Queen of Swords. They, they want to cut this out. They want a break. You might be on a break. They may be contemplating divorce, separation. You could be dealing with a Libra because there's an other woman or other man. You're contemplating a move, or they are. Uh, someone's emotionally confused about this partnership. It might be legal issues, the judgment. With justice here, yeah. So for air sign, uh, Aquarius in particular, they want to really work on this with you, Sagittarius. It's up to you if you want to put the work into it. If you're going to do that, um, some of my Sagittarius have two. My Sagittarius men have two women, either an earth sign or an air sign, and the outside woman is uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And then my Sagittarius woman, work is heavy for you, but stability is here. Someone wants to partner with you. Someone wants to bring tr true partnership with you. Could be an earth sign. Yeah. Taurus. Night of, yeah, wow. Okay, okay. Um, Aquarius, uh, I keep saying Aquarius, wow. Um, Sagittarius woman, it looks really good for you. Um, if you take the offer, if you want to really work on this situation, could be with the Capricorn Virgo Taurus, um, Aries. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But definitely heavy earth energy. They they want to... Um, they like you a lot. And they really want to establish something strong and lasting with you. You are wish fulfillment for them. Um, it's it's like you're doing the juggling act though. But in there, they might be doing the juggling act in, in regards to do I offer this person this? Because they seem so strong. And... Um, really uh, confident and strong by themselves that's what I keep hearing <laughs> it's crazy Sagittarius woman it looks good Sagittarius man or, or if you're a cross watcher you're dealing with a Sagittarius I mean, it's been the same for a while now. Sagittarius is trying to get out of something, go to somebody else, ask two different people. Mm. All right, energy, supporting cards for Sagittarius. Three additional support messages, okay. For self-employment, wow. And I said that too, like, for some of my uh, Sagittarius men and women, but definitely the women I'm feeling, I don't know why it's so feminine energy here. Um, Self-employment is, is good in the sense of money is coming in. You are abundant in that realm, but it is very taxing to your energy, to your, your well-being. And you need to get creative on how you preserve yourself. All right, there it is. Gracefully aging. All right, nice. Welcome the new. Nice and join in at the bottom of the deck. All right. Okay. So join in with this for my people who self-employment is taxing right now. Um join a group a physical group not online a group that can help you with creative solutions to of how to run business and run it 
even more smoothly and more successfully in the sense of conserving your energy working smarter than harder that's it uh, for some of you you need to join um, physical groups that will put you around like minded people whether that's my singles if you're looking for someone join a group of interest meetup.com is a good way of meeting people just people in general that share your common interests and then you can expound on that you know if you're looking for a love partner it could come by way of getting out there and doing things for the possible is for us to do the impossible is for our god whoever your god is to you uh, so do the possible and um the creator will meet you with the impossible okay all right so don't don't be so impractical like i want to meet a husband and you never go anywhere you never do anything you aren't a part of any groups you go either to work or home or how about this some of you work from home and say you want to be somebody no one's coming to your home no one's knocking on your door for the possible is for you to do it's possible for you to get out there get out there all right gracefully aging when I see this car, there's lots of things come up. Okay, so for some of you, you need to you need to stop and think about different regimens. Do you have a regimen? Do you have a beauty regimen? Do you have um, a way of preserving yourself outwardly and then, of course, inwardly? But we're going to speak about outward appearance because that's what people firstly see. People don't see your soul when they look at you. Um so be cognitive of of how you look how you dress we're not talking about you know you have to go and buy the the most expensive thing or anything like anything like that just i always tell my daughter three things be nice be kind and look your best no excuse me be smart be kind look your best those three things because most people are inclined to one of those three things some people are very shallow they they judge people exactly on how they look so you want to look your best whatever your best is some people are so inclined to oh my gosh this was such a nice person that's why you want to be nice you want to be kind some people are inclined mentally they you know they want to know where you are mentally that's why you have to be smart be sharp so gracefully aging look look your best put on your best whatever you know and uh evaluate yourself if you know you haven't been taking care of yourself just get in the game go to a department store um go to the beauty counter and Tell them what your concerns are. And they'll point you in the right direction to spend all of your money <laughs> um, to fix that. Fix that. Anyway, welcome to new. Something new is coming in for you. For my Sagittarius women, it looks like someone really wants to partner with you. My Sagittarius man, if you can ever get out of your situation, maybe you will have new. Maybe it will be beautiful for you. I don't know. Um, but uh, my my Sagittarius woman excuse me guys um something new is coming in for you and it might be really really good for you okay all right there we are if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel definitely click that like button comment 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 like uh request a personal reading head on over to the website the information is below um and request that that special $15 reading, all right? So, Sagittarius, I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care. Bye, guys.